Okay. Let's have a look. Yeah. This is terrible. What to do, what to do, what to do. So it looks like their armies have ran away. So I could probably just jump in and try to hurt some people. They'll probably see my army and come and attack me. Uh, a noble has distinguished himself in the battle. Perhaps I can make use of him. Uh, Petuia. Petu Petuta? I don't know how to say that name. Let's have a look then. Petuta of Plock. Ah, 18 Marshal. Yes, he could be a good man. And we have 9,000 men coming. We could probably defeat them. Then again, here's a lot of heavy infantry. How many infantry do I have? Uh, five fa Actually, I have a lot of heavy infantry. Huh. Maybe we should be able to defeat him. Light cavalry. I have like no light cavalry, basically. He's a, he's a lot more than me on that. Can we defeat him, though? It's quite close. Do you know what? Let's do it. We might as well. Might as well fight him. Hopefully the others, his allies, don't get here to help him in time. Are they gonna are they gonna get here, or are they just gonna continue walking slowly towards us while the game loads for the autosave? Eighth of July. There we go, and we're at battle. The battle has commenced. This is the first time we fought the Franks, or shall we say the French? I guess they're called now, because it is France. And it looks like we're winning, though we've lost a lot of men, but they're losing morale. Okay, looks like we're probably going to win. Perfect. Ah, oh, thank God. That will give us a good percentage. Uh, you were in the thick of it during the battle, and your tally of slain enemy soldiers has impressed even the most grizzled sergeants in the army. As you clean the blood splat off your sword and armor, the men cheer for you uh, for the bravery you displayed in securing this victory. Yes, songs will be sung at this day. Okay, that did not really help us percentage-wise. We have 8,000 men now coming up to help. They now have more men than I do. They're going to run away. So that was the France army. Yeah. Okay, well, we're going to wait here for now. We'll see what happens. I'm not going to chase after them because, yeah, look at that. 19,000 men are coming. Let's get out of here. Let's cross the river quickly. Come on, guys. We need to get across that river. If that 8,000 men catches up to me, then these guys will catch up to us. And that's a lot of men. The Knights Templar. So the Knights Templar are definitely not someone we want to mess with. And I can obviously change you for uh, Vogvalod. Oh, my son. Yes, of course. He should lead. Uh, and this one, there should be someone else. Yep, that Putieta. Guy distinguished himself in battle. Okay. So we've got a good army there, but just not enough troops. I'm going to keep them on the other side of the river for now. But it looks like they're continuing to come. Looks like they're continuing to come after us. We need a new spy master. Uh, she is the best, and she does like me. I'm going to pick her for now. Uh, my spy master scheme. Perfect. Okay, they're, just, they're turning back now. They're not coming after us. Looks like they're turning away, yes. Yep, still they're fighting Saxony. How far has it gone so far? So Saxony's winning. That, that war is going to go on for a while. I don't think we'll get their help. That was a bad time to call a crusade. Bad, bad time. Yep, then they're, they're walking away now. They're not coming after us. The question is what to do now. We won't have enough men to defeat them. And my allies are just constantly throwing their men in to be slaughtered. I think this is a lost cause. I think this is a lost cause. Yep, yeah, the, the combined powers of uh, the Teutonic Order, Lombardy, Bavaria and France is maybe too much for us right now. Yep, that's just too much. We are not taking that on. <laughs> There's a bit... Oh, okay, they're coming after me now. Brenneberg. When did they get here? The 8th of January. I did not notice that at all. 
The 11th of January, great. 6th of January, okay, we can get away. Okay, let's just go here then. See if we can get away. I don't want to get into a fight with them. They have 13,000 men. More men look like they're coming. So, uh, that is not like a good choice. Even if they are crossing a river, still, I don't think it's worth the risk. Oh, sorry, I had my button on the thing. I think on the button. Uh, let's head this way then. So he's still coming after us. Looks like no, he's turning back. Uh, upgrade tribal settlement. Perfect. So there we go. Uh, Zetgale, uh, Zemgale has been turned into a castle. Perfect. Ah. We still have many things. We, look, we have lots of things to build. It's going to take a long time. But we will build this great nation. We shall become a power. An eastern power of Belarus. We'll have to wait and see, though. Hopefully we can take advantage of the French later. But I think this war is lost. Not much we can do in this situation. Bavaria seems to have gained a bit. Tyrol seems to have taken over down here. Asturias. Everywhere else looks the same. No one else seems to be doing anything. Just us. There's obviously a Khazaria. Jesus. Can they reform the Tengri faith? Let's have a look here. Tengri. One. Two. And there's the third. And fourth here. And the fifth is somewhere else. Uh, over here. Okay. Let me check. So you have this. Byzantine Empire has this. And it was this one. Okay. So they're one away from able to reform it. So maybe they can't right now. Okay, another guy entered the war. Bit useless, but okay. The Mary of France, he's been maimed. That could be interesting. He only has two sons, though, so only split the realm into two, which is a shame. Would have been nice to have more. Is he French or Frank? Yes, he is French. It looks like the French are in control. Frankish culture has maybe died out. The tribal ways have gone. Looks like they're heading down south. Yep. My allies just keep sending wave after wave of men to meet their doom. Basically useless. I literally can't see a way around this. Normally in a, a war I can see a way we could possibly win. But in this one right now, I can't see anything. Look at that. 18,000 men right there. Lombardy's got a bit in here. France here. The Byzantine Empire has moved its capital ah, to here. Okay. Uh, we have some land here that's not part of anything. They've become independent. And she's a woman. So will it leave her dynasty? Yes, it will leave her dynasty. Okay. Hmm. 26,000 troops. Yep, nothing we can do there. Probably should just give up right now. Yeah, at the moment we're the biggest percentage because we're the only ones actually done anything right now. We're the only ones actually defeated an army. <laughs> Damn it. Ah, so someone inherited it. One of our family. Want the family to be strong. Okay, he joined the war as well. Again, it's not really going to help us. How are High Lords doing then for... Uh... They're all developed down here. So all the High Lords have developed up. Uh, this one has... This one still... You still need help here. Just one more. You know, I'm going to give you the money. Actually, no, I need the money just in case we face a revolt. At the moment, we're likely to face a revolt and the tribals can get lots of men, so I need the money for mercenaries. I'm sure he can afford it himself at some point. 
Right now, only eight of our vassals, or our direct vassals, are actually feudal, it would seem. You've loads of money. God damn you. Build that damn thing. We just need that Saxony war to end. How far along is this? Okay, Pomerania is starting to now push back. Looks like they're starting to win. So because I finished that Pomerania war, it looks like Pomerania can actually fight back. And he only has daughters. Interest. I'm the genius. Ah, would become the heir. I am married to one of them as well, I think. So she would have a claim. Yes. I do plan to use that at some point, hopefully. Two lovely daughters. So we have, we have one son who's great at talking, one son who's very strong, and they have two sisters. I think that's a good mix. Let's just go, uh, I could just, oh, okay, it doesn't have attached units, because I can't go loot in. There's too many men there right now, let's just try and go south then, let's just go to tap Bavaria. Just for funsies. Maybe there's not too many troops down here, maybe they're all up north with the French. Maybe we could just take some land, gain some honour. But there's no way we can win. No, no way. Futile efforts to try to gain glory for the Slavic people. Foolish, foolish. Uh, our prince, our king would say, Sudoslav. Sudoslav does not agree. I'm going to move because I cannot see. Oh, Jesus. Okay, yeah. Okay, we're going to a fight. We can win, but I'm just worried other people might come. Okay, we won. And they didn't come to help, which is okay. A noble has distinguished himself, Nikita. Uh, he's okay. So we won another battle. But it doesn't really help us. You can see the 64% still hardly made a dent. Because we have those 20,000 up here. We lost too many men in that attack to really it be worth it. They've almost have like 30,000 now. Though they do seem to have disease. Disease looks like it's rife in the west of France. Interesting. We have no disease. Our people are happy. And healthy. Which is important. Karuna down there. Granada still seems to be about. Granada's managed to survive so far. I just want this war to be over, to be honest. I can't see how we can get out of this. The Byzantine Empire has a revolt. I wonder if the Teutonic Order can declare a kingdom. They're so big. Uh, this is my daughter? Ah. Underhanded rogue she has become. Okay. Interesting. She, seems, she looks like a nice daughter. A load of these random armies down here. Fania, we've got Kiev down here. But other than that, we have a 62 realm size. I think we need like 180 to form an empire. Let's check. Yeah, 180 to make an empire. But obviously that's because uh, each province of ours only has one thing on it. We need to develop it. Really. Well, most of them do. So we improved intrigue. Oh, no bad ambitions. Okay, fine. Guess I can't choose a new ambition. Yeah. King Sudislav. Who you a better marshal? Ah, you're probably right. Are you the best marshal there? You are with Alexei. I don't want to upset him. I rule in the kingdom of Belarus. I'm sorry, Sam. I'm sorry. I'm a proud man. You don't go against what I say. I'm patient. I know what I'm doing. I fought this thing through, son. He's a high, high, uh, he's a Dutch, a duke, sorry. I keep playing Game of Thrones. It means I keep calling him the wrong thing. Uh, he's a duke. We need to look after him. Our knowledge and keep, of keeps improved. 
You know, just all our armies just pouring in. Just waiting for this to be over, basically. Finland has a revolt. We have land up here. It's completely useless. There's a Swedish revolt at the moment. Who rules in Finland? Afmunzo, great general. And also over here. Are they brothers? No, they're related some way, but I don't remember how. You could probably look at you by looking at allies. They're not allies? Oh, there they are. Uh, just same dynasty, okay. So they're too far away maybe to be a cousin or something. That's good for them. Up in Britain, the Pickland seem to have gone into uh, seem to have gone into Ireland, which is nice. Uh, we can do up something. It looks like this castle infrastructure, town infrastructure, church, improve creeps, trade. Let's go for trade. I feel like we'll be trading now, and then construction or improve keeps. Construction or improve keeps. What would this do? Okay, get new things. Construction. Build time is less. Let's go with that because we're trying to build lots of stuff. Okay, done. No one seems that close to creating England, but we do have this. Britonade. Britonade. Ah. Britonade. So that should be, I would have thought, Wales. I would have thought we created Wales. So we basically have a kingdom of Wales here who've eaten a large chunk of a. Uh, Western and Southern England. And we have Northum Northumbria up here. It's getting quite large. Okay. We now have 7,000 men. Don't know where all our men disappeared to. Looks like a lot of my men have gone. Not sure why. Hmm. Yeah, where have all my men gone? I seem to have very few. What's going on here? Hmm. Yeah, I don't seem to have too many. Let's send our men back. Do you know what? It basically seems like a useless war. There's nothing I can do. I'm going to get rid of my armies. I'm going to get rid of our armies. Nothing I could do there. The uh, Holy Order can be raised by someone else. I'm sure someone else will. Hopefully they can use those men. I basically had no men helping anyway. Only like 2,000. Disease though, going around in France. Hopefully he gets ill and dies. But 85%, yeah, we would have lost anyway. There's nothing I can do, I'm sorry. I'm sorry to disappoint you guys. If you wanted to see us take over. Slavic man here. No, of course not. Ah, he's not at peace. 